In this video, I'm going to be demonstrating how to use a web-based TI-84 graphing calculator emulator. Uh, the website that we will be using is this one right here, so the first thing you should do is navigate to that website in one of your browsers. All right, when you do that, this will be the page that you will load in your browser. And as you can see right there is your TI-84 uh, Silver Plus Silver Edition that's going to come up. All right, now, as it sets right now, it is not a working emulator. Okay, so the very first time you navigate to this web page, you will have a Terms of Service box here that is in pink. You are going to need to agree to their Terms of Service which basically just says that you are using a legitimate ROM image all right, that you have downloaded off of your own calculator that you have purchased. All right, so you're going to need to hit I agree right there. Okay, Then that box changes to a location where you can now import your ROM image. Okay, I am assuming that you um, in some other video or you already have the know-how to have a ROM image and have it pulled off your TI-84 calculator. So you're going to hit choose file and then you will navigate around to wherever you have your ROM images stored on your computer. All right, I had mine um, just in my documents folder. All right, and I have a folder called ROM images. That's where mine are stored. Okay, now I have two different ones here because I do want to demonstrate both ROM images. Um, first of all, I'm going to do the one that runs the 2.55 math print version for the older grayscale TI-84 plus calculators. Alright, so once you click that and load that ROM image, okay, then the calculator will become active or working. I can press the on button and then you can see that it is running that 2.55 math print version. Alright, and you can see that it is in grayscale. Alright, once you do that, the calculator will be a regular functioning calculator. You know, I can do an 8 plus 8 there. If I wanted to, say, do a graph, I could go into my Y equals and do like a 2x squared, maybe say minus 4, and then hit the graph button. It is going to work exactly the way in a regular TI-84 would work. Okay. Now, um, this should remember that you have loaded that ROM image. You ought to be able to close the browser, open it back up. It continue, should continue to work unless you clear your history and your cache and all that kind of stuff. In which case, if it would ever stop functioning or it would, you would clear your cache out, you're going to have to load a new ROM image. This little disk icon right here, if you hover over it right there, you see it says load new ROM image. All right, if it ever gets screwed up or you just want to load a different ROM image, you can click right there. As soon as you click right there, then this box comes back that allows you to, again, import a ROM image. So even though I have a working ROM image in there right now, I can choose to load another one. So now I'm going to load the newer color version which is my other ROM image here. I just want you to see how it's going to change. Okay, the whole calculator and everything changed. And this one now is the TI-84 Plus C Silver Edition. Okay, so a little different. And because this version of the calculator has higher screen resolution, they've had to make this uh, viewing window just a little bit bigger. So you can turn it on. And again, this now will work just like um, a regular TI-84 does. All right, showing you that you're running the 4.2 version on this. And again, it does regular functions to add or subtract or whatever, but much more crisp, clear screen there. Um, let's do a graph just real quick. Okay, now you can see that the colors, you've got the colors there. So your 2x squared, let's go ahead and do the exact same one that I did a minute ago. And it's going to graph it. Much more clear picture and in color. Okay, so depending on which ROM image you have to load will determine what the calculator will look like in your browser window. So definitely thanks for watching. Be sure and give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Thanks.